Hey everyone, it's Brian here. Today I'm coming on to do something totally different from what I usually do on my channel. Today I'm not going to be doing paper crafting. I'm actually going to be using this wooden crate from the Dollar Tree and some Jenga blocks like these. And I'm going to show you how to make a truck out of these for fall harvest season decorations. So let's get started. Okay, first thing you want to do is, I'll show you, I'm going to put, some hot glue along here, like so, just pop it on, push it down a little bit, it should adhere pretty instantly. I found out when I did the, one of these yesterday that it's, this glue adheres very quickly onto wood, so that's good I guess. So you don't know, have to sit there for long waiting for the glue to dry or to cure. And now what I'm going to do is put some glue on top of on top of these and set this the glasses fell off again sorry about that I want to put just like so I have to move it over a little bit possibly uh oh <laughs> doesn't cure too fast uh oh okay so I'm just what I can do here is just glue that back down glue that there too and just not worry about that it's not where exactly where I want it to be but at least it's somewhere on near where it wants to be what I wanted it to be was to be exactly centered between these two but it didn't happen but that's all right okay so next what we're gonna do is go ahead and Put some hot glue on this corner here, right there, and put that like so. And then we're going to put another layer, I mean another one, on top of that. Don't worry about cleaning up all these hot glue strands later. And now we're going to go ahead and do the same thing again on this side. And then repeat just like I did the other side with this one and just push it down push them together just make sure everything sits nicely so this what we got so far is um, the front is being made, and this is going to be like the, the cab of the truck, basically. And now what we want to do is go ahead and put some glue on here. And do the same thing over here too. Now, I'm sorry if you can't see this that well. My camera is my phone is my camera actually, and I don't think it's doing too well because it's kind of sitting where it usually is, and I don't usually need it up higher than it is. 
So I do apologize if you're not able to see this that well. I do apologize for that. <clears throat> now what I'm going to do is go ahead and start putting together the hood of the truck, like so. much there. That's fine. It'll be okay. And now you see here we got a little if I were to put one more here I would need a little, that would make a little lip so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put two more on here because I had the same problem last time with this I had to add another set of um, blocks to the front I'm gonna put in a new glue stick while I'm at it This is what we got so far. And now we got to put one more Jenga piece on here. And that's going to go right over here. And then, um, then you'd want to paint the, after this, you're going to want to paint the wood, like maybe a red color or something. And what I would suggest is after, after after you paint this, you can put some like poker chips or some foam core board you can cut out to make tires and put them on here and here and on the same place on the other side. But this is what we got here is a nice little truck, the beginnings of one at least. And you can put like little pumpkins or little hay bales in there in the back to make it look festive for the fall. So that's all I got for today. Hope to see y'all real soon. I hope you all enjoyed this project. If you did, please do give, hit a like, hit the like button, and subscribe if you haven't yet. And leave me a comment down below telling me what you think of this project. I'll see y'all again real soon. Bye.